All right, so my right, cards. Yes. So what are your cards, Austin? I have, I am a, I am Abraham Lincoln, right? Whose bottom half is a sloth. Oh. And I am a thousand years old. Oh. So I could totally beat you. Okay. Well, let me see what I am. I'm a giraffe that shoots glitter. <laughs> Does not say from where, so I guess that's just left to me. <laughs> I also have a time machine photo booth. Okay. okay, first of all, do you do you have you seen Abraham Lincoln like like yeah, how in person, grizzled yeah. and just like purely manly he is? Grizzled? Like I'm I'm sure he had massive arms. I haven't seen them for myself, but like you know, I've seen Abraham Lincoln Vampire Slayer, so I'm sure I'm sure that he's he could easily take your giraffe and mm -hmm. that time travels and shoots glitter yeah. easily in a fight, uh, based on this knowledge of the character through that brilliant portrayal. And, um, you know, even with his bottom half as a sloth, you know, like, he could he could easily, like, do a handstand on yeah. his arms and just walk around and, like, yeah. slap you in the face. Right, and, that, right with your claw talons, yeah. that's what you're thinking. Uh, yeah, exactly. And um, so, so I think I think this fight wouldn't be difficult at all for Abraham Lincoln slash sloth guy. This is so cute. This argument has just been very sweet. Because you, you, I, you're really, you're just, you're thinking that I'm going to be fighting Abraham Lincoln as a man. I'm going to use my time machine photo booth to go back to the time where either you're a baby, I'll, I'll decide when I get there, or either you're a baby, or I'll just go kill your mom when she's a baby. I can do anything I want to do in that situation. I'm going to go back in time, probably when your child, like a small child, so swaddled in your cradle with your creepy little sloth. You're, this is that point where your sloth parts aren't even developed. They're still pink and like mushy. I'm going to take my giraffe in there, I'm going to shoot... I, we're just, we're just going to ignore the glitter part of this draft because that's just going to lead to bad places. I don't even need it. Lead to bad places that are disadvantageous to you. <laughs> no. <laughs> Glitter's coming back in. Yeah, defend that. Yeah. Shoot glitter out my nose. All right, this draft shoots glitter out of its nose, Austin. It's going to come in there. Oh. It's going to come in. This is not your time to breathe. This is not your time to talk. It chooses when it shoots. It's not. This is not. It's not a constant stream of glitter. It's. It's whenever I decide. So I come into your home, your log cabin in Colonial America. And I'm going to come in there. Your dad's going to be gone. Your mom's going to be doing something that colonial women do. Knitting, making dolls. I don't know. Emily Lincoln didn't need parents. <laughs> you think he didn't need parents? He didn't need parents. Well, he was a okay, grandma from birth. <laughs> you, got, you got no parents. I'm just going to go in there. I'm going to use my... I'm going to kind of stick my big old giraffe neck in your window, and I'm going to glitter you to death. I'm going to cover your baby body in glitter so that either you suffocate, or maybe you're out and about. Maybe you're with your mom. I'm going to use my big giraffe neck to beat the freak out of you. Break your little baby body. Kill your mom while I'm at it, Austin. What's up? That's right. how I'm going to win this super fight. I was just like to point out one major flaw yeah. in your argument. Well, well, one wait. of my cards says I'm a thousand years old, okay? How do you even know I ever like was a baby if I'm obviously this like immortal person That's your who's problem. a thousand years old? That's your no, no, but nobody with a normal lifespan is a thousand years old. I wouldn't be old and weary. I'm someone who obviously ages a lot better than the normal person. Right. So like, obviously I'm like immortal or something well, like I, that. You know? I completely appreciate the fact that you are one thousand years old. I do appreciate that, <laughs> and I have taken that in into consideration. Your main flaw is that I have a time machine to go anywhere. I can go, I can visit you at age. I've probably been anywhere you if I'm a thousand year old you like you're like a thousand years old. I may even take you on as a thousand year old man. My grandpa's 83, can't go to the bathroom by himself. What I'm do you not think a normal person. What do you I'm think you're doing as a thousand year old man? You probably can't even see. You probably can't even eat. There's so many... Austin, you can't win this, man. <laughs> you cannot do this. My glitter weaver cover. Like, I'll just go into a room where you're in. You're in this room. This room has one door. All right, you can leave this room one way. I stick my big giraffe neck into the window back there. The giraffe I, necks are not that long. They're they're not like like. Sure. I don't even have to I mean, get it. I don't have to get it. I don't have to get it midway into the room. I just have to get it in the window. I'm gonna snort out this glitter, and it's gonna like be so because it's an indefinite amount. It does not give me. It does not say four pounds of glitter, four milliliters of glitter. It's just glitter. So I'm gonna fill this entire room with glitter, and you're gonna suffocate with it. This this bite, one way or another, ends with you in so much glitter you can't move. You can't breathe. You can't be anything. You are simply buried in glitter. We we need a moderator to like make sure that that. What do y'all think? What, what what okay? What what do our judges think? I'm sorry, I got passionate. Okay, well, yeah, wait, hold passionate. on, yeah. Let me get the camera out. Yeah. Okay. This is really hard, but I have to say that the, the glitter giraffe would win, just because like you're half sloth, Abe. You're a, you're a thousand. You're a thousand. You're, 
I'm a thousand because I age much better than the average person. <laughs> like I get the like pyramid. I can still argument. be in my prime. <laughs> I can still be in my prime. I think I think that's fair. Sorry. That's fair. What about you, Rose? Who do you think? Um, you know, I think Abe might win because the, the giraffe with the glitter would be just so cute that it wouldn't. <laughs> you wouldn't kill anyone. You would just like sit there and stare at. I don't. Them I don't think you yeah. understand. Yeah. This, you this like, giraffe is from the badlands of Africa. <laughs> this giraffe has seen some things. <laughs> this giraffe has done some things. This is not a cute giraffe. This is a damaged giraffe. giraffe sure, but through the tiebreaker here, you're gonna have to pick so, someone here. No, no. Uh, probably the giraffe. I don't really think that a sloth. A sloth man. A sloth man can't. Sorry, Austin. (laughs) That's okay. That's okay. All right, all right, guys. So our judges have decided that the uh, glitter giraffe would win. However, let us know in the comments who you think would win, and join us on the next Super Fight video. Also, check out our gaming channel. Is where I will be doing some let's plays on just various games with uh, a comedian with a com. A comedic. Com- a comedic. A comedic. A comedic. 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 Funny commentary. So so check that out in, in the description. We have the link. We have the link to our sponsors, Top End Gaming. If you're interested in comics or just geek culture in general, comics, games, cards, whatever. They're the ones that provide us with the Supercard set. And we'll see you guys in that, in that next video. <laughs> Very very well. I had a hard time making an argument there. (laughs)